I'm just gonna say, you kind of do look like Jesus Christ. Would you like to give Jesus Christ a second chance on the second coming of Jesus Christ? Um, yeah. My roommate. Ash, what are those? I decorated too. Here we go. Oh, look at this. Look upstairs. Australian flag and all, ain't that beautiful? Wait, you Australian? No, my roommate is. Who's your roommate? Oh, Adam. Shit. Yeah, I did everything. Adam. Wow. I'm pretty good at this. Did you see? Wait, see the bedroom. Come over here. This is impressive. Look at this. This is actually really impressive. Holy shit, it feels natural. Yeah. I try to color code everything. Ha! <laughs> that is actually impressive. <laughs> that's that's Adam's office. Well, last time I was there, last time I was uh, in our house, uh, it was on fire. So this is oh. much better. <laughs> All right, um, come outside. Top bit as well. Hey, Rachel, what's up? I get attacked by dogs here. Found Wait, a spot? She's not told him yet what's going on. No, she hasn't told you him. found a spot. Oh, at the funeral go. Um, just go, go, um, yeah, I'm, I'm fine. Just, we'll have it, um, have it at the, uh, have it at True Marsh Pier. Thank you for no, the no, I'm not. Just have it at True Marsh Pier. Go and get True Marsh. It's, it's, the, it's the pier on the left-hand side of Ocean, of uh, Grand Ocean Highway. It's not that far away. It's not that far north of uh, the Billabong. If you go to Great Ocean Highway, you'll see a pier and it says True Marsh right next to it, right next to a 24-7 behind a gun store and clothing store on Great Ocean Highway. They might be together. We never know. Adam, so you got to think Adam's been working and trying to get Emma <sighs> for a very long time. Things. Do they need help? No. Um, I got a lot to say. I'm sorry. <laughs> I shouldn't have told you what I did. And it was stupid that I felt the way that I did at, uh, at the Chatterbox situation. It was dumb and stupid of me. And honestly, every day, I've regretted it. And I felt childish oh, no. ignoring you. And I felt stupid not covering it up. The fact that you still care after how little effort I put into caring back said a lot to me. The fact that even on, during my funeral, you hadn't seen me in over two months, you still came to say good day. I couldn't be there though. I felt that they weren't, they were stopping their efforts to try to find you, you know? I can't be supportive of where I was. It has been three weeks, Emma. I know, but... I don't lose hope that fast. There's a reason why I work my ass off. I, I was just say in the past three weeks, since you went missing, since I found out you were missing when Barry told me, I literally worked every day to make sure that if 
you show up, I'm the person there. Aww. Oh God. But what? Nothing. I'm gonna be honest. You saying what you did, and you know, ending things with us, and saying you know, try to. You know, I, I you're too dangerous for me. I told you. Somebody else said that to me. I'm giving that person a chance right now. If he fucks up, he fucks up. Right now, he, it, it feels like all he's trying to do is buy me off because he bought this house. He's now trying to send me money every day. Somehow he made 150 k in one day, which I don't even fucking know how he did that. And it's not uh. like you don't hold a spot in my heart because he knows out how much I care about you and how much I love you. And I think that intimidates him, but I mean, I already told him I would never be able to replace you. And he knows and he understands. And I told him I'm taking things slow with him. And no matter what, me and him don't work out. We're still being roommates. It's, he's one of my best friends. Huh. Oh. Doesn't put down how much I love you and care about you, though. <laughs> You're the one that got away. You, every every girl I look at, I just think of you simply because I just I just can't believe how badly I fucked up. Well, you like, don't. Damn. You kind of didn't fuck up. I still care and love you. Yeah, but you got someone else now, don't you? Literally, I have been dating Adam for two weeks. We are best friends. He's the one who told me I'm too dangerous that. I I'm sorry, you can't be with me. You have to go find somebody else. He did the same thing you did to me. Then how about... <laughs> I feel like right now I'm the second coming of Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm just going to say you kind of do look like Jesus Christ. <laughs> Would you like to give Jesus Christ a second chance on the second coming of Jesus Christ? Oh no, guys! <laughs> how about we go out and hang out and see how that is first, okay? Let's hang out when I'm back from the dead. Yes, because you're dead right now. I did get promoted, by the way. Oh, what too? I'm a solo resident. I work by myself now. No more person watching over you you're all nobody your watches over me i hold it down by myself even though i have my clock that kidnaps me and pours gasoline on me while i treat patients so <laughs> go on it's not a... no you're fine if you have to answer the phone answer the phone fuck mike block okay he a bit but <laughs> oh they call me doc block so i'm kind of untouchable by them i'm also untouchable by the dance That's good. Yeah. Um, I promise I'll make this right. <laughs> Wait till Adam find out. I'm sorry. God, you really need... Oh. Uh. Yeah, you're, you are very tan and very, very scruffy right now. You do look like Jesus. You know, you probably won't believe it, but. But, uh. You know, I do feel like the second coming of Jesus Christ. <laughs> nice. Simply because, uh. 
Because you came back from the dead, basically? <laughs> no. Because God did send me back. It's not the God that you're thinking about. That's a shit ton of sirens. You'll find out one day. Uh, yeah. Adam might get kidnapped. Adam... Adam's a uh, gun... <laughs> gun person, most likely. I'm not gonna say shit. We'll just say Adam's a gun dealer. Okay, everyone's hey, naked. Sir. How you doing, honey? And she didn't say they're gonna go back together. He said they'll hang out. Oh. You need a ride somewhere? I got a car. That's fine. Okay. I didn't show you my car yet. I'll see you then. Adam Prince. I gotta go, Emma. All right. Be safe, I miss please. you. I miss you too. Please be safe. Nice house. You didn't see my car yet. She didn't say no. No, she did not say no, guys. <laughs> I'm gonna gamble!